Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's Brandy Giz, and today I wanted to bring to you something that was sent to me for reviewing purposes, and I hope you're interested in something like this because I am. Uh, I was contacted by the company Filippo or Filippo Loretti, and they sell a lot of men's watches as well as women's watches. They also sell accessories like the cases that you would put in the watches. And I was interested when they uh, brought it to me. They have um, a, a variety of watches that were sent to me. So I'm going to share with you all. I'm going to do an unboxing. And this is the box that it comes in. This is the name of the company. Filippo Loretti. Yes. And packaged very nicely. And inside that box houses this right here. And that let's open up and let's see the uh, actual watch and again here is the box really cute packaging and everything and the watch I picked I wanted something different for me uh, but I picked up man's watch because I like the big face so I actually went with the black face and I thought this was re like really cute and it has the Filippo Loretti on it so on here you have the months, January to December. You have your days 1 through 31. And you have whether it's Saturday, Sunday, you know, the days of the week. And I really like this watch. I like the gold in the inside. I like this little matte black. I want to take it out so that you can see it. Actually, it comes in a really nice box. And before I show you the watch, let me put this to the side. Before I show you the watch, this is the information it comes with, like a cloth. You also have your warranty. They give you uh, defects, a 10-year warranty, a limited warranty. And uh, the warranty does not cover normal wear and tear, aging, scuff marks, all that stuff, damaging, um, resulting from improper handling and, and, you know, handling of the Filippo watch by a non-authorized person. So it just tells you how to set your watch. I'm going to show you this watch. And this is a really nice timepiece. Isn't that cute? I'm going to put it, I'm going to take this watch off. And remember, I'm going to put it on this arm because I don't want it to clash with my bracelet. So, yeah. Okay. So this is the watch. I thought it looked really, really cute, right? So I'm going to take this plastic because they give you this plastic to have it covered. And this is the watch. It's so pretty. Now I might need to size it a little bit because it is a little bit big on me. But I think it's really, really nice. And uh, the timepiece you now own makes you a part of the Filippo Loretti family family members care for one another so if you ever have any questions regarding your timepiece or any part of your order don't hesitate to email us we hope you enjoy the admiration and compliments you're going to receive with your new Filippo Loretti timepiece where it proudly will sure you're going to love it Daniel Jacutis and Modest Jacutis this is a really nice timepiece and again check them out I'm going to list everything down in the description section of the video. They sell uh, stainless steel gold mesh bracelets. If you don't like the black, they have the stainless steel. They have the rubber straps. They have regular straps. And this is their, this is the site. Different. They have a lot of women watches, but I really wanted something different. And as you can see on here. Okay, so once again, I picked up the Venice Moon Face. This is the Venice Moon Face timepiece, which I uh, do like. They have 50% off going on right now if you're interested in something like this. They have free shipping, easy 90-day returns, and they have a 10-year warranty, 100% no-risk money back guaranteed. And a little bit about my watch that I picked out. It has the stainless steel bracelet, this stainless steel mesh bracelet. I'm going to bring it in so that you can see. It has the stainless steel mesh bracelet. It has that sapphire glass. They have, like I said, the date of the month on the wheel. It has the month wheel and the moon phase. 
and again it's stainless steel the diameters is 40 millimeters the uh, the case thickness is nine millimeters the strap again stainless steel it's water resistant movement and all that other good stuff um, I told you about and it's in and it's inspired they said by uh, Italy inspired design inspired by st. Mark's Bellisca in Venice and its iconic silhouette and they have architectural work let me show you on the back of the watch that's the architectural work and again the moon face is an elegant moon face complication it adds a touch of sophistication and that's the moon phase down here at the bottom so this is a really nice luxury wash at a fair price so I want to thank Filippo Loretti for sending me this here beautiful timepiece to uh, share with you all so I hope you all ch go over so again I want to thank Filippo Loretti for sending me this beautiful timepiece and I hope you all take the time out to uh, check out their website you know Mother's Day is coming you might want to check their website site out uh, Father's Day is also approaching and just to give a gift or give a gift to yourself so again I want to thank them for sending me this here product and let's move on to the vlog hey guys it's your girl Brandy Giz I'm at home and um I went to my favorite restaurant today yes I did it's Friday it's the weekend and um we were out so I decided to get some of my favorite restaurant, which is Garifuna Flavor here in Chicago. Okay, so I have the, I believe it's called Conch. It's their number one appetizer. I don't think it's called Conch. It's a their number one appetizer. I'm going to put the name of it. I can't remember, but I know this is uh, supposed to be good. And then I got my my regular schmegler, which is y'all. I get this all the time. The oxtails with the rice, the macaroni, and the sweet potatoes. I love their oxtails. It tastes so good. So I had a long day at work. So um, I had to work today, and I want to try this these little balls for y'all y'all already know i love the oxtails okay i don't know what this is i think this is kind of like a a slaw let's see let's bless this food bless this food lord that i'm about to receive in jesus name i pray amen okay it's warm though let's see oh it's spicy it tastes like a spicy coleslaw, but it's hot. And these are the balls. <laughs> it's good. Let's have an inside look. I know it has some kind of fish in it. Yeah. She told me it was the like number one appetizer. So let me get off of here. I'm going to get down. Then I'm going to take my shower and unwind, but I got to eat first. All right, I see y'all. Peace. Good morning, y'all. It's your girl, Brenny Giz. I am back. I went to this little, you know, little, I call it the ghetto area. I went to this little, I call it the ghetto spot to get my feet and my nails done. Um, I only go here when I just, it's an emergency where I need it done right away. I might, I don't know. I want to start back doing my own nails, but I just got a neutral color on my nails. As you can see in my feet, I'll insert. I got, um, yeah, my feet, I got my feet done. I actually got a polish change. I didn't even want them to do the whole thing. But right now, I am headed back home. 
because I have some videos I need to map out, mop, map out. I have some videos that I need to do. So, yeah. I do want to stop at TJ Maxx. I love stopping at that store. Let's go home. Let's go home, Brandy. No, do not stop at the store today. Even though you think that they put out something new. All right, I'll see y'all. It's your girl, yes, I'm back and I wanted to show y'all that I'm in the scene Came to the outlet. I think these are so cute. I like them. But not for no 188. I'm gonna have them in blue, y'all. And the baby blue. on your foot is better than the shoes. These are cute little pinnacles. Now these are the funniest looking shoes I've been seen all day. What the world? They cute, but they ugly. just coming off. I need a bigger size. You know how you find yourself starting to like the shoe? This would be cute with a different color polish. Why I like glitter shoes? And why it's so dark in here? Hey y'all, what's up? It's Brandy Giz and I'm finished shopping. But right now I am at Philly. What's that place called? Charlie's is the Philly cheesesteak, and I'm gonna show you what I got. Don't it look good? Got my sanitizer, my sweet baby rays, and my orange, my sweet baby rays, and my orange soda. So yep, this is my meal. This look real good. If I put a dollar more, I would have got this for free. 
A big bottle. Now these are the shoes that just do it from Nike's. These are the ones that, so these are the uh, Nike's that I picked up from the Nike outlet. These are comfortable, something that I can just throw on and wear to work. And yeah, they're like the training shoe, but I like them. And this is how it looks on my foot. Yes, that's how it looks on my foot. I like them because they're kind of comfortable. I brought another pair that are black. They were cheap. So I had to get them and I bought these. These are black, all black, nothing fancy, but they were uh, a good deal. So I ended up getting them and they fit kind of fit big, but I just think about like, if I have a sock on, you can probably see them. So let me take this out. Okay. So show my foot. Why are you shaking your head? how the shoes look on my foot. You see it? Just some basic black shoes. What you think, you like them? Let me tie them so that y'all can see. And these were 49. So these were 49, I could use them for work. I didn't tie the other shoe, but I like them. This is how they look. Yes. Thank you. Okay, sorry about the lighting. Let me see if I can bring y'all a little close. Okay, I'm sorry about the lighting, but I wanna show y'all the little that I got from the outlet. I picked up um, my son some like everyday blue and white Nikes from the outlet. And what else did I get? So that's all I picked up from the outlet and that was like really inexpensive. Then I went to the CCO and I seen some Clinique, what is this called? Moisture Surge, I guess it's for your eyes. It is for your eyes. It's the Moisture Sur Surge Auto Replenishing Lipid Sphere Technology. It's supposed to help your under eyes. So I'm gonna try this. I think it was like $17 and this is it right here let me take it out the that boy ate my sandwich i should have just brought him one yeah so this is how it looks so if you've tried this let me know is it working for you all and while i was in there why did my friends talk me into getting that i don't fool with tom ford because tom ford perfumes be so not expensive, yeah, on the expensive side, but this was like cheap. But they're so strong. And this is the Tom Ford Flor de Portofino. I, Lord, I swear. And it smelled good on my arm, right? Here we go again, Brady. For real, it did smell good on my arm, but I'm like this. I ain't taking it back. It'll just be on my 
perfume counter. I'm gonna see. I'm gonna let you know because you know how when you in a store everything smells good. But some of that stuff she was spraying on me, I didn't like. But this is the bottle. So and how much was it? It was like on sale. Let me see. Here's the receipt right here. We will gladly exchange or return merchandise for a store credit only within 30 days. We ain't going back out there. This was 50% off, y'all. So they had this for $60. Yeah. So let me sp let me spray it. That's a cute bottle, right? I'll let y'all know how it smells in a few minutes. Then they gave me 20% off one single item. Oh, that's cool. This is from, oh, okay. And it's valid from, okay, until August. So this is a good thing. But yeah, this is the cute little bottle. I'm going to keep it. It smells floral at first, you know, at the first spray. Yes, baby. That's not good. The sandwich is good. Mm -hmm. He done ate my sandwich, y'all. I'm so upset. Did you eat all of it? Yep. What about the fries? No. Y'all can't have nothing. Y'all see, I was. I didn't eat all the sandwich when I was out. But so far, this one is um, smelling okay. I don't have those. It's not too strong. It doesn't have that almondy note. So this is a really good um, fragrance for the summer. So. Give me a few more minutes because you know how I am with fragrances. Don't run out and get it now. But if you have a CCO, it was only $60. I bought some Miss Fields cookies. What y'all know about Miss Fields cookies? They have some good um, cookies. So I guess I'll get him some. What else? Then we went to Saks. Saks Fifth Avenue. We were trying on shoes and everything. I seen some gym shoes that I really, really wanted. And somebody took one of the shoes out. Yep, they took one of the shoes out, and I couldn't find a mate. And I wanted those gym shoes so bad. They were so cute. So I ended up getting these. These, I don't know who this is by, but it has that Hermes-esque, like, um, if you look close enough. It has, like, those rhinestones. Really, really pretty. And you know you could just throw these on when you're going out and it has like rhinestones all around this cute shoe yep so i thought these were cute they'll be cute with uh, if i have like a different color um toenail polish on because these toenail polishes that i have on which is green i just wanted to do green because it matched my coat but um i probably do a cute like white toes or pink to bring out the shoe then i picked these up i thought these were cute for the summer as well they look like that this is the bag and it has like that leather strap and then i like this because this is plastic but it has that white around there so these are cute for the summer Okay, and I found a jogging suit by Terry. I don't know who this is, but yeah, I don't know what's up with me and these tie dyes. But I purchased this, so hopefully I can fit it. I didn't even try it on, and it was inexpensive at Saks Fifth Avenue. And I picked up the um, the sweater as well, and the sweater is in the large, so like on cool days like this like today is like really really cool so i can like wear something like this and that is it you guys that is all what's up y'all before i end this video i want to come back and tell y'all i know y'all probably tired of me in these perfumes but i love me some perfumes and i just ran up the stairs and i was like let me tell them about this perfume this smells really good I am super excited. Now, I actually was like, let me smell some Tom Ford fragrances. She started showing me some Tom Ford fragrances that I wasn't really interested in, like Black Orchid, That's Too Strong. And a lot of the fragrances I've smelled before that are popular, but that don't necessarily mean that 
I might like them. I smell them on like co-workers. I have co-workers that wear perfumes and different things and um, either I don't want to smell like them or that's their signature scent. I let them have it. You know what I'm saying? But I just like something different. So when the young lady showed me this, I was like, this smells kind of good. It smells more uh, lady. There was another bottle. It was a little bit darker. It smelled like a man's cologne. I didn't want to smell like a man. So I ended up, she showed me this. I put it on my hand and I'm like, hmm, it smells okay. Let me walk around and if I like it. And then she was like, it's 50% off with additional 10%. And I'm like, let me see. So I ended up getting this bottle and I kid you not. I like it. I like it. And I like it more than that. What was that perfume that I had? See how I forget the name? That Twilly. So we don't even remember Twilly no more, y'all. This right here is nice. It smells lady. It smells fresh, clean, summer, white linen. You going out to brunch or, you know, just a really nice, on a really nice date. This is a really nice fragrance to wear. So this is Brandy approved. I'm going to put this on my dresser i wish i got the big bottle because this is something that i i really like so can you believe it a time for fragrance girl i don't even think i own any time for it um lost cherry she tried to sell me and in nordstrom's it smells more almond but at the cco it smells more cherry which is okay um at the time i really really wasn't interested in it but i like this one I like this one so and I keep smelling it it smells nice it smells nice it's not too floral where it gives you a headache or anything it's not aggravating my sinuses which is a good thing and I wore it all the way home and that was like a 40 maybe an hour drive and what else um and I like it I still like it so yeah I just want to update you on this sorry I'm talking too much but I just wanted to let y'all know that the Flora di Portofino Aqua is a nice scent i love the bottle this is so summery and i'm ready this is the box that it comes in y'all this is the box that it comes in and it's a 1.7 fluid ounce and i think i spent 60 60 dollars on that twilly and look i got this for 60 dollars with additional what 10 percent off girl yes so, and then they gave me a 20% off coupon. They shouldn't have did that. Because I might go back out there and buy. Let me shut up. Let me shut up. Let me shut up. Okay. I'll see y'all. Love y'all. Bye.